Hey everybody, so um, just sitting here tonight, eating some popcorn, and uh, I was thinking about something. So, you know, a lot of people look at Ashley and I, and they say, you know, what weight did they have to lose? They have losing weight. You know, they're always skinny, which isn't actually true. That's not true. We did have some weight to lose. Um, but more importantly, what I want you to think about is like your perspective of where you're coming from <clears throat> and how you view yourself in your mind. Um, for me, for instance, right, I was a 34 waist, maybe even a 33 when I was in college. Um, very quickly, after finishing school and starting work, I became a 36. A couple of years after that, I was 38. And uh, refusing to admit that, I was probably on my way to a 40. But, um, you know, since then, I've worked my way back down to a 34. But point is, um, you know, I always viewed myself as right like a 34, even though, you know, I was a few sizes above that. So, you know, yeah, it was, you know, 25, 30 pounds, give or take. But it was more about, um, you know, for me, the sizes and, and what I was used to. Hold on a second. So, um, you know, I want, I want you to look at that because whether you were, you know, a size zero at one point and now you're a six or you're a size, you know, you were a size 16 and now you're like a 24, um, you know, it's important to, to remember it's all oh, perspective clicking. on where we're coming from. Here. One second. Um, so, you know, everybody has their own image of, you know, who, you know, who they are and what they used to wear or, you know, what they want to wear. Like Ash, you know, she had a ton of clothes in, in her closet, which was her why. Um, and I just remember that, you know, and, and it's not necessarily about the pounds, but maybe, maybe more about the sizes or the inches. Um, and then back to the clothes for a second. So figure out your why. You know, what really motivated Ashley was... You know, she had this this awesome wardrobe that she couldn't fit into anymore. And thank God for us, she didn't go out and buy a new wardrobe, but, you know, chose to do over life and said, you know, I want to fit in these these awesome clothes that I have and wear them again. Um, you know, and that that's what motivated her. And, you know, um, it's important. It's important to have that why. Otherwise, you know, you're not going to you're not going to stick to it. You're not going to be successful. You're going to start. You're going to stop. You're going to fail. You're going to have some success. You're going to, you know, fail again. Maybe try again, but you really need something to, to keep you focused. Um, and then the other point is, uh, you know, back on the, you know, hey, they didn't have any weight to lose thing, is, you know, people might have looked at us and might have thought we were skinny, but we weren't healthy. I was not healthy. Um, you know, I had headaches all the time. I was lethargic. I was tired. I had really bad allergies. You know, that's just to name a few. So, you know, you can be skinny, but be very unhealthy. Um, so, you know, just a couple things to think about, a couple things that were on my mind tonight, just sharing. So everybody have a fantastic evening, great week, get ready for the holidays. We did our treat today, looks lovely. Scarlet and Sienna are eating all the candy canes already. But, um, you know, might as well eat them, right? Because we just end up throwing them out at the end of the year anyway. So, enjoy, see you soon.